Hello, hello, folks. Uh, my name is Keith Harrell. I'm the executive producer for Cast and Couch TV, and we're here doing a very, very goodwill event called the Grooming Gents. This is the second year that we're doing this. Um, what we do is haircuts for young boys right before school starts. We're here with Teddy Harrell, Jr., um, the founder of APAC, African American Performing Arts Community Theater. And we're here again at the Grooming Gents event. Ted, tell the audience out there a little bit about what APAC has done and doing with this organization and, and, and as far as the Grooming Gents is concerned. We build ourselves on a wonderful slogan that stands for building better community through theater. And this is one of the things that we do with helping to build better communities with you. This wonderful event that you've done with the Grooming Gents and um, making sure that youth in this community are getting their haircuts. This is incredible. It's incredible for theatrical people, uh, actors, uh, to be involved with this. Just not just to be on the stage, but to also be doing something like this and making sure that um, uh, we're serving our youth. We're serving our community. We talk that talk. We walk that walk. But this is it. We're walking the walk today. We're doing it. We're doing it. You're doing it. And we're happy to be a part of this with you, your Kappa Brothers, your Gentlemen's uh, Acquisition uh, Program. I mean, this is incredible. The Big Time Boys, this is this is what it's all about. It's, what, it's all about us, all of us, coming together to make sure that we're helping the youth in our community. We're here with uh, Kappa Alpha Psi Fraternity Incorporated, an um, uh, organization that I'm very uh, proud to say that I am a member of. And we're here with the Miami Alumni Chapter. And with the Miami Alumni Chapter, I have our poll mark uh, that is here that is with this, uh, this phenomenal event that we're doing, uh, Chris Frazier. Chris Frazier, can you please tell me a little bit about the significance of uh, Kappa Alpha Psi as far as the things that we're doing here in the community? Well, thank you, Keith. Uh, one of the best things about Kappa Psi is achievement, and we always try to help our youth. And we're here today to help support your cause and our event in terms of giving uh, school supplies as well as haircuts to young young children that need it for schools. And as I said, you know, Cap Alpha Psi has been around for well over a century. And with us being and doing things here in our nation and, and abroad, yeah. Yeah. you know, uh, internationally, uh, we feel that it is important that we always give back. Now, I want to introduce you to uh, a, a gentleman that's also doing some great things within our chapter. Uh, his name is Maceo Pickett, and he's going to tell you a little bit about the Kappa League uh, that we got going on right now. How you doing, Mace? Very good, Keith. Thank you very much. Uh, yes, um, in the Miami Alumni Chapter, um, uh, as the poll mark stated, we really believe in community service, and one of our... Um, National Community Service Projects is our guide right program. And in that program, we have our Kappa League, which uh, is our leadership development program. Um, in that program right now, we're targeting high school students from the ninth through the 12th grade. Um, and uh, with achievement being our goal, we wanna make sure that we set up these young men uh, to be very successful, um, not only in, in college, but in subsequent life after that. We're here with Fred Brett. He is the instructor professor uh, for the um, Barber College that's here at William Turner Tech. Um, Fred, tell us a little bit about your program that you have here. Well, um, what we do here is uh, prepare those who want to enter into the barbering field. We prepare them uh, through uh, hands-on experience and through uh, textbook on how to prepare themselves for the state exam. Um, the class has been ongoing for the last 10 years and uh, I'm happy to say that I've been blessed to have uh, put a lot of guys and ladies into the field uh, by coming through this program. Uh, we also have a cosmetology program going on here. Once a kid is uh, get his hair cut, he has a good feeling about himself, you know, he does well. He does well in school. So that's what we try to do and we try to portray this here uh, as far as what we're doing with these kids. Mm -hmm. 